cancer so what you guys can possibly expect for the next uh, let's take three weeks from now until the end of the month so what's happening with the sign of cancer what's the current scenario i hope you guys are doing well welcome back to the channel so here we go the first sign we have for you is six of swords so many of you guys could be walking away or have been trying to stay away from problems issues um, you know things that uh, create drama in your life or you are staying away from drama altogether top card we have for you is ace of pentacles many of you guys are focused on uh, focused on something new many of you guys could be relocating your house or uh, going for a new job after you were not happy with your past job uh, if it's in terms of relationship i see you moving uh, forward towards a new relationship if it's not a new relationship i see you moving uh, on from something uh, you were holding on to for a while okay maybe even a year okay so yes one more card for sign of uh, cancer. What's happening to the sign of cancer, please? With King of Wands, I see you getting your mojo back, getting your passion back, getting your vibe back. Okay. With High Priestess, you have been uh, underground or you have been distant from people or you have cut your social ties for a while. And I see you getting back that vibe, that mojo uh, in a for life and, you know, finally vibing uh, your, your way back to life. Okay. Um, so, yes. In terms of your soulmate, give me one card for Cancer and your soulmate's connection. What's happening in terms of your soulmate connection? With Eight of Pentacles, this person, I believe, on some which level has been very selfish, okay? Like they have been focused on their own life, doing their own thing, not really bothered about your uh, this connection. Right now, I do not see them uh, being emotionally available towards you. I see them working on themselves, focusing on themselves, working on, on their finances, their life, um, okay? So one card for how do they view you now? How does the Cancer soulmate view Cancer now? One card for how do they view you now? Do they truly view you now? With five of swords, this person is upset with you. Okay. Uh, I believe that uh, in in the past they 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 were uh, playing mind games with you and you dropped them. So right now they are upset with you. They uh, they are kind of uh, you know they like 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 whatever they were uh, their plans were uh, in in order to get your attention. They not work. You basically dropped them. Okay. So they feel like uh, their games were one of the main reasons as to why you dropped them or their uh, toxic ways or their narcissist uh, you know uh, thinking could could have led to this you having to make a choice of dropping them to move forward towards something else in your life okay how do they think about you now one card for how does the, uh, uh cancer summit think of cancer now how does cancer summit truly really think of cancer now one card how do they truly really think of cancer With Ace of Cups, that's the funny part, right? This person is 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 wanting to return back, but I do not see commitment. Um, you know, them offering you commitment. They want a connection with you. They want a relationship with you. But I still see issues with commitment. Why is that? So, what's the main blockage here? What's the main blockage that's stopping you from coming together in a connection in a relationship? It could be that either of you are married. That's the reason why you know King of uh, Pentacles Rios is someone un unable or not in a position to give you commitment. What's the main blockage that's stopping the two of you from coming together?
with five of pentacles it could be that this person left you out in the cold and you don't you have trust issues now you feel like this person is going to repeat it again out of nowhere this person uh, had dropped you in the past or it could also be that cancer had dropped you this could be for wise uh, for for the cross watchers you know working vice versa for you but whatever it is someone got distant it could also be that for selected few of you you guys leave at a distance long distance relationship if it's not that it could be financial issues someone is not financially stable since we have king of pentacles in the reverse and uh, five of pentacles it 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 uh, very very much points to the fact that someone is not financially stable okay so one card for their energy towards you now cancer soulmates energy towards cancer cancer soulmates energy towards cancer moving forward what's their energy towards cancer I believe that if if they were juggling between you and someone else, okay, I I I feel like they are going to make a decision of returning back to you. Right now, they are fearful that you are dropping them and you are moving on. They feel like you are moving on, to be honest, okay. So one card for their current feelings towards you. What are their current feelings towards you? Cancer soulmates, current feelings towards cancer. Cancer soulmates, current feelings towards cancer, please. Uh, in terms of feelings, we have Knight of Swords. So I see this person charging back. If if with Five of Wands uh, in the reverse in the past, I I I I I believe they were fighting with you. But right now they are in a position of compromise or wanting to compromise. But I still see indecision. On some which level, there is still this, uh, you know, this, uh, this, this thinking that they have that you know they are not uh, going to be able to go full circle with you or to have everything with you. Okay, but they are returning. They are going to charge back. They are going to reconnect. So, what are they wanting to offer you now? What are they wanting to offer you? What are their intentions towards you? What are this uh, the cancer soulmate wanting to offer cancer now? What's the cancer soulmate truly wanting to offer cancer now? One card for that, please. I still see Queen of Cups in the reverse. Okay, I still see Nine of Pentacles. For many of you, this person is not in a position to offer you much. I still see emotional independence. I still do not see this person wanting to stay with you or wanting to build something with you. I still see this person holding back in terms of opening up emotionally and building something on a very strong, uh, uh, you know, on a very genuine level. I do not see that, to be honest with you. Okay. So where is this connection possibly moving forward? Where is this connection possibly moving forward for Cancer and their soulmate? One card. Where is this connection possibly moving forward for Cancer and their soulmate? The month of September. What can my dear Kansas possibly expect for now? With Emperor card, I see you being in control of your life. You not being, uh, uh, you know, like sad or crying over this person. I see you finally getting your vibe back. I see you getting that stability back in your life. I see you being at peace with yourself. Okay. With the Lovers card, you will have choices. Okay. Moving forward, I see you having choices. Uh, but the problem is your person does not want to commit. Okay, I do not see commitment. I see them uh, wanting to keep things open, like an open, casual relationship. This person could be someone that is not really wanting to, you know, uh, let go of their freedom or, or their independence. They want to keep their independence. They want to keep their freedom, and that is not someone you can commit with. Okay, so yes, so what are they wanting from you now? What's the Cancer soulmate wanting from Cancer now? What's the Cancer soulmate truly really wanting from Cancer? What's the Cancer soulmate truly really wanting from Cancer now? One card for that. They want, uh, um, you know, 
they want you to offer them emotions they want you to be open to them they want you to take that risk and move forward but for some of you i i see them wanting a casual relationship okay if you are in a third party they still want to continue that they do not want to completely give in to you okay so i still see this person wanting you to be open to them and wanting you to continue showing your emotions to them right right now i believe your person is wanting you to open up okay so let's see their messages towards you like what are they wanting to say to cancer now what are they wanting to say to cancer solve my message to cancer please sexual thoughts so yes i do feel this person is wanting to have something fun with you something casual I know you're the one and that scares me. So this person knows that you are the person they would want to end up with but still there is this fear, okay? And top card is uh, tell me you still want me. Okay? So that's that's something narcissistic of them, you know. If they cannot offer you commitment, they shouldn't be expecting things from you, you know? So that I I feel like this person still wants you to be open to them, still wants you to express your emotions for them and still wants you to basically hold on to them. Okay? So yes, this was your reading for the sign of Cancer for the month of September. If you resonated so far, please be kind enough to consider hitting the like button, subscribe if you haven't subscribed yet. And if you are new to my channel, please uh, you know, hit the like button, comment and and subscribe and if you are wanting to follow me on instagram you can follow me on divine soul guidance all those who are wanting a personal reading with me could go to my website and book one if you having some difficulties you could email me and let me know about it thank you so much for coming in and see you soon guys happy month of september cheers